against violence and racism. Residents in Tehachapi coming together to hold a rally for Charlottesville. That event originally scheduled for immediately after that violence, but postponed after finding threats online. 23 ABC's Morgan Wheeler was there in Tehachapi tonight covering the rally for us, and she has more for us tonight. That's right, the demonstration that happened tonight was in regards to the three lives lost in the violent clashes in Charlottesville, Virginia. Stacy Petz wanted to send this message to the community days ago. We just wanted our voices heard and, and we wanted to stand with other people in the country and show people. The rally she was a part of this Sunday called off as threats streamed in online, hitting at similar violence, much like the car that ran into protesters in Virginia. There was threats of running us over. At the advance of Tehachapi police, they held off until tonight. No, we don't want to make a war or a fight with anyone, but we're not going to go hide, you know, in the closet <laughs> for any reason. Seems like the voices or the shouting, the, the anger drowns out people who are want to be peaceful. Coming together in effort to not let what happened in Charlottesville happen in their backyard. What happens when something happens to one of us here? And we, and we didn't say when we had a chance, that wasn't right. Pets wanted the community to know she peacefully stands with them. We stand, you know, in unity with our community. We don't want to see anyone hurt. Equality for all Americans. The rally ended up being a peaceful protest, and they're just happy their voices were heard. In Tehachapi, Morgan Wheeler, 23 ABC.